Hey, what's up guys? Mike Red Fox. If you've been following my channel for a little while, then you probably know that I use bots to buy GPUs for mining. In this video, I'm going to give an update on what bots I'm using and show the success that I've had. So back in the summer, I made the decision to really just go down the bot rabbit hole. And what was happening, I was just getting sick of jumping at every notification, every in-stock alert, and just coming up empty. And all the ways that I was getting graphics cards in the past, I wasn't able to anymore. And what I later learned is that bots were just taking all those cards out from under me and all of you. And so I decided I still want to compete. I still want to get graphics cards for mining. I'm in a great situation to pay them off quickly. And mining is still really profitable. So I just have to go into bots. And I know that bots are used by scalpers, which is not me, by the way. Bots are used by scalpers to get hard to get items and then sell them later for a profit. That's how this all works. So I had to go hang with all of them in order to learn how to use bots, get bots, get it set up and learn how to have success with it. So in this video, I really want to walk through what I've learned, the bots I'm using, and show you the purchases that I've made over the last several months since I got into this. So I made a video back June 5th is when I did my Stellar review, and Stellar is one of the bots that I use back then and continue to use now. So I did a review on it back in June, and I was only having a little bit of success with it back then. I was still very much learning the whole space of bots and all of that. But really from then till now is the update and I'll show you any of the purchases that I've made since that time. And so let's do that. Let's start with that. So I'm gonna head over to my server here. It's arsonservers.com. We'll leave a link to it in case you need it. And this is one of the changes I've made. I now run my bots off of a server instead of my local computer. And the reason I wanna do this is that my ping to, in this case, Amazon server is as low as possible. The location of this server is closer to Amazon servers than my physical location. So it makes sense for me to be there, right? That latency is lower, so I have a better chance of beating the other bots I'm competing against to make the purchase to get the checkout. So let's start with Stellar, right? That's the GPU I did, uh, that's <laughs> that's the bot I did a review of uh, back in the summer. And this is it here. Might be a little small on the screen, what we were looking at is all the purchases that I was able to make since June 10th up until present day. And so you can see a lot of graphics cards here. I was able to get some 6700 XTs from AMD, um, 3080 Ti's, 3070 Ti's. This is my my favorite purchase I got was a actual non LHR 3080 Asus Tough. You'll see some uh, PlayStations here. I do that for friends, coworkers, uh, family members, just at, I sell them to them at MSRP prices. Bunch of uh, 3080 Ti Zotax I went up canceling. By the way, 3090s, more PlayStations. Um, I was able to get some, I don't know if they're on here. There's some 3070s I was able to get from Newegg, open box. I, my, most of my most recent ones is this EVGA 3060 from Walmart. But you can see uh, 32 total checkouts going on the last several months um, using Stellar. And if we go over to the new bot that I'm using, that's called Nova. And this is it here. And in Nova, I've had even more success. Again, just running Amazon on Nova here. And you can see with Nova, you can ignore some of these Barbies <laughs> and Pokemon cards. I was running them by accident, so I had to cancel those. But looking at just graphics cards, most recently, just got a 3090, um, bunch of 6600 XTs, a 5700 XT, 3070 Ti's I went up canceling, a LHR 3060 Ti I might keep, another 5700 XT, some more PlayStations for coworkers, Red Devil 6700, uh, 6600 XT's, 3080 Ti's, 3070 Ti's, 2060's, and a 3070 Ti at, at the bottom there. And the first thing you might be thinking is, Mike, that's like a lot of LHR GPUs, but that's that's it right now. That's the landscape. You're with a bot, you're not gonna get a non-LHR GPU right now. They're just not available. I think those days are over. And that leads me to one of the first things to talk about, like 
realistically GPUs that you're going to be able to get, you're going to be able to get pretty much any GPU you want based on its availability. And the availability is LHR GPUs. That's it. And then the AMD GPUs, the 6600 XTs you can get as well. But that's the landscape right now. So if you're thinking about going into botting, you're like, I'm going to get a non LHR 3070. It's just not going to happen because they're just not being manufactured. So just be realistic about what is available. And yes, the bot will help you get it. That's what its job is. And it will do that. The other thing that I wanted to take a look at is just to give you some more visibility on this here. Uh, this is my uh, success channel in my discord. It's hidden. So only I can see it, but these are all my checkouts, right? And you can see the prices, the dates. This is my most recent buy on the 10th. So what is that? Three days ago, I got a 3090 from Amazon. Here's those 6,600 XTs, 5,700 XTs. Again, ignore the Barbies. That was an accident. Um, this is a 3060 from um, Stellar that I was able to get. But yeah, I mean, this is it. This is real. This is happening. This is That's one month's worth of purchases. This is my the best ones. These are coming really soon. These 6,600 XTs. But I got 13 pages of checkouts here. And what I do is... I let it check out and I might decide to keep it or cancel it or see if a friend wants it and I don't, I don't resell them. I don't scalp them. These are my, these are some of my really favorite checkouts here. This is new egg open box, non LHR 3070, two of them. Oh man, that was such a good pickup. That was a month ago, but yeah, you can see GPUs, right? You want them. This is a way to get them. Whether or not it's worth it is really up to you. But those are the two bots that I'm currently using. Again, one is Stellar and the other is called Nova. And I'll leave links to all this down in the description below. And you may say, all right, Mike, like that sounds great. I'm ready. I'm going to buy these. How much do they cost? And that's where things get tricky because neither of these bots are available for you to just go on their website and buy because they have to keep them scarce so that they're still profitable for the people that are running them. So the best thing to do is you have to buy a key from somebody else who has one or rent a key from somebody else that has one. And you can do that as well. And there's two marketplaces to do this. I have not personally done this myself, but there are, these are highly regarded marketplaces in the scalper community. So you can use Botmart is one title marketplace is the other. It brings you over to their Discord channel. You learn how this all works. You use a middleman so you're not dealing directly with the person that's given you your key. You follow instructions so you don't get scammed. And you can give it a try. Maybe rent it for a little bit. See if it's if it's something you're up for. But there's a lot more below the surface besides just download bot, hit button. And this isn't the video for me to go through all of that. This is for me the video for me to show you how I've done using these bots so that you can take this data and decide for yourself if it's something that you would like to do. I'm really happy with where I've landed with them. It was a little bit of a slow start, but thinking about some of the amazing pickups that I would not have been able to get without running either Nova or Stellar, I would not have been able to get those non-LHR GPUs open box. I would not be able to get those 6600 XTs that I was able to score. And I'm really stoked on all of that. If you're thinking about just these two bots, Here's kind of how I would size them up. Nova's easy. Nova's first. Nova's, ju Nova's just Amazon. And in my experience, has been better than Stellar on Amazon. So if you're looking at just run Amazon, I would get Nova. There are other bots out there, by the way, besides the two I'm talking about. They're just the two that I have. Where Stellar shines, is Stellar is good at other retailers besides Amazon. It can do Amazon. But you can already see I've gotten purchases from Walmart on here. I got purchases from Newegg on here. I got purchases from Best Buy on here. So Stellar is more of a well-rounded bot. But Nova, in my experience so far, I could be wrong, but in my experience so far is better at Amazon, which has more regular GPU drops. So that's it, guys. I know many of you have been asking me, how's it been going? How your bot's been running? Because you're continually curious as GPUs continue to be really hard to get and mining is still profitable of how it all works before you invest your money in figuring it all out. And there's a lot to figure out. And I will happily help you in my Discord if you need some help getting started on this. But know that there's a lot more beneath the surface than just buying or renting the bot software. You got to get a server. Is highly recommended like i showed you there so that's another 
uh, cost that will be associated with this. You have to get proxies to run all your traffic through. So it's not banning your server IP address or your local IP address. Um, beyond that, you're going to want to join a cook group, which is a, a discord channel that'll give you info that you'll need to set up your bots and just give you tips on when GPUs might be dropping or they're hard to get items. And it's, it's work to keep everything updated. So it may seem glamorous, download bot, hit button, GPU shows up at your door. There's a lot of work that goes into it, but reflecting back on the last several months, I would not have been able to get what I've been able to get without using them. If you're looking to get one GPU, two GPUs, not worth it. If you're looking to get dozens of GPUs, as many as you can buy, in my opinion, it is worth it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope it was helpful to you. Hit the like button if you did. Subscribe for more content on GPU mining or botting software. Join my Discord if you want to chat or have any questions about all this stuff. I'm in an open book, super transparent with all of you. And as always, guys, please take care of yourself, take care of each other, and I'll see you in the next video.